Bruton Morrow. So uh, pleasant of you to show up. Uh, pleasure as well, sir. It's... What is this? Is a handshake, sir. Oh. No, 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 no. Please, watch me. Okay, okay. Uh, no touching. Okay, okay, no okay, sorry, 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 sorry. You see? Yeah. Now, if you wouldn't mind taking a seat. Make yourself as snug as a slug in a rug. <coughs> now, I've been looking over your CV and... Oh, I beg it as a wiggy! I haven't even offered you a glass of water. Would you like some? Uh, uh, thank you, sir. I've been feeling very parched today. Parched? I never was one for street slang. Uh, parched? Sir, it's a common phrase. Uh, uh, keep your thoughts to yourself. Uh, uh, okay. Now. Now, I've been looking over some of your qualifications. Very impressive stuff. What is it? Um, um, nothing, so huh? nothing. Now, Oxford and Cambridge, sumptuous, but no Greendale. How comes? Um, Greendale's not a real college. Hmm, all right, yes, hmm, very interesting. So, Mars, was that not an option? We can't get there. Hmm. Very disappointing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, I see you did a volunteering program in Venezuela. Uh, yes, I did a teaching program where we go to third world countries and teach kids how to read or write. Yes, huh, sure. What about the crab people? Uh, I'm sorry, sir, the crab people? The indigenous tribe of the crab people. Why not help them read and write? You know they're only four foot tall. Um, sorry sir, I was just busy last summer helping up the lot of the people, you know? <laughs> you mock me, boy? Uh, no, no, of course not, sir. It's just, it's just, it was just a bad joke, it's a bad joke, sir. I'm, I'm very sorry. I'm sorry. Snip, snip. Now, I see you have under hobbies and interests... Brain teasers. Uh, yes, I like to keep my brain active. No one cares about brain teasers. Let me tell you about a hobby of mine. Competitive mooing. I'm sorry, sir. Competitive moo! Well, I'm passing more into competitive barring. <laughs> <You know? laughs> this interview will not be going much further if I experience any more of this tomfoolery. Of course, of course, sir. Apologies. Of course. Now, I was just looking to inquire about Think Fast! <laughs> what was that? Mm. So pathetic. Weak. Now, why do you want this job? Uh, uh, the job? Uh, well,. Well, because I, I believe I think we are a great fit for this company. Look, I'm hardworking, I'm dedicated, um, I'm, I'm dedicated, I'm, I'm hardworking. I feel like I can bring so much more to this company that like I can really dedicate towards the job and like I'll be like, super hardworking to this place and, and... Sorry, what? <laughs> Will you make a sandwich the whole time? Don't worry about that. I keep notes. Now. If you are partying and a prostitute overdoses on ketamine, what do you do with the body? <sighs> well, I, uh, me, I would can't come clean and go to the police.
Mm. Not sure about that. Mm. Well, thank you ever so much for coming in today. Oh, no, uh, no, uh, uh, thank you, sir. Oh, sir. <laughs> Call me your majesty. Uh, okay. Uh, your majesty? Very good. Well, bury the whore. There's the door. So how'd it go? Hard to explain. But I feel like he didn't like me. I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, if the job's not for you, it's not for you. Yeah, I guess you're right. <sighs> Green Dealer? Green Dealer! Thank you. If I knew you were coming, I would not have wasted one second with this fool. <laughs> <laughs>